Oh, somebody's happy to be home. Hello, chickens. Everybody seems to be. That's all we got left. And uh, Rue, wherever he is, I think he's in the coop. One, two, three, four, five, six. Rue! Where are you, Rue? Did you guys eat him? <laughs> Did you guys eat Rue? <laughs> Where's Rue? Hi, ladies. What did you do with Rue? Anybody want to speak up? Ah, uh, oh, there's Rue. Hi, Rue. <laughs> uh, Hi, Rue. How you doing, buddy? You're looking good. <laughs> you still don't cockadoodle do either. Everybody still picks on you, though. Poor guy. He is pretty, though. But hey, guys. <laughs> We're not here to talk about the chickens, are we? No. We are never here. Well, I don't want to say never. We're not always here to talk about the chickens. We're usually here to talk about... Oh, where'd they go? Well, they were like... <laughs> they were like right there. I lost my horses. Oh. Well, if you know my channel, you know who I'm talking about. Ah, I found them. They're over there. <laughs> They're in the barn. All right, let's go see them. See what they're up to. I know Jarvis is dirty, it rained. Let's see what they're up to. So I hope you guys did really good this past weekend. I have not been putting up a video because the company that I work for right now is getting ready for market which means uh it is kind of like the expose of uh the furniture world and they prepare everything and they put it all together high point turns into some crazy world and people from all over everywhere come and look at all the new designs and the new furniture and what they can do with it and this year is supposed to be spectacular so there they are Hi boys! Hi Friday! Friday! <laughs> Hi Jarvis! <laughs> so, there's a couple of things that I want to do. These guys are doing really good, as always. They are getting big and they're getting fat. Hi! You're not getting fat. You're not fat. <laughs> he doesn't like to be called fat because he's not fat. No, you're not fat. You're trim. <laughs> so, but in order for me to show you the video that I was thinking about, first of all, we have to turn back the hands of time. Hi, guys. All right. This is Snowy. Hi, Snowy. How are you? What are you doing? Do you want to help? Hey, you want to help? We're going to do mail call. Yeah? <laughs> so I just want to do this really quick video you guys um it's uh Thursday I get to work from home today so this is what I look like um so I went to the post office and I was expecting a package from my business partner and she sent us some tack that she bought from elsewhere and um, there was another bag in there but first I want to show you what uh, my business partner sent to me These are really, really cool. All right, I'm gonna show you the purple one first. There's two, there's a purple one and there's a black one. So this, this is like the newest rave, I guess. I've been seeing an awful lot of these kind of halters lately. And I'm gonna tell you, this is like kind of nice. I had a halter very similar to this, um, made out of the same material when I bought Jarvis. And it was really, really nice, but it kept on coming loose um, a little bit. You know, this the type of material it is, it's that super shiny, super soft type material. Um, but this is really nice. It's got the really nice, I mean, this is soft, you guys. 
is a nice silky soft and it's got a, a little shoe fly on the bottom and then it's got a little shoe fly on this side or like on the, the side and of course I have no idea somebody who makes these things in India India you guys really need to learn how to tie these things it came this way okay quiz time you guys what's wrong with this <laughs> this is not how you tie one of these halters a halter okay you, you don't know that's not how you tie this okay <laughs> oh my gosh you guys are crazy all right so here's a lesson okay here's your horse head all right this is the front of the horse's head here okay that's his nose you've just put this over his head okay this goes in just like this all right it goes towards the eye back around under well no behind behind towards the eye under the loop all right it's hard to do it this way <laughs> under the loop and back okay so you're making a knot under this loop here okay not over under so when this pulls it pulls tight <laughs> but you can still get it undone see when it pulls this pulls tight okay this is the loop you see it it pulls tight and all you have to do is go boop with your thumb and it undoes but your horse will not learn to pull and this will give away and he'll break away and you've created a bad habit so here's the black okay this is tied incorrectly the loop and the knot is over no wrong <laughs> Very wrong, India. It goes under. So it does not come undone. Under. So it looks like a giant knot. Okay, but it's not. See, you just do that and it comes undone. Easy peasy. One, two, three, easy. So anyway, all right, I'm gonna fix this one. All right, so. This one is tied right. <laughs> All right, so now that you guys have seen this, this is really nice. I like this one. I think this comes undone. I think it comes off of it. It looks like it would, but um, I'm not really sure. And I'm not gonna untie this because I don't know how to tie these back this way. But this is a purple one. This is really super nice. And then um, there's the black one. Ooh. And here's the black one. I think this is this is heavier. Oh, because it's got a different end. This this one has got a nice little shoe fly end on it. And this is this has got just I think this is longer. It looks longer. Oh, this is heavier, it's longer. It doesn't have the shoe flies at the end. So if you don't like them, it's just a plane at the ends. But this is really nice. This this Looks like it might fit Jarvis if I wanted to, but I don't think so. This has just got the knots. It's very, very nice. Very sleek. Could you imagine seeing this on Jarvis or even seeing the purple on Friday or whatever? This is really, really nicely made. This is nice. It's soft. It's a little bit, um, I don't know. It feels like it's a little bit more tightly woven than this one. I don't know. It's pretty. I like them. Okay, so um, they're tagged for $25 a piece. These are going to go up on eBay. Um, but you guys are going to see them first because I just took it out of the... This is longer. This is heavy. This is going to be longer. But I just took it out of the bag. So $25 bucks a piece. And um, I'll chip in on the shipping. So um, if anybody wants them, $25 a piece plus uh, pay ship $7 in shipping. Shipping is generally about eight nine dollars because I put them in a box. I don't put them in a bag. So, ah, <laughs> you guys are gonna fall off my table. All right, Ooh, don't go anywhere. All right, so then I thought this was something else because I I was expecting another something because I bought something for the, the trailer. Um, 
for my neighbor's trailer a couple pieces so i thought this was this so it's already open but this is not this wasn't what i thought it was so i i'm gonna show it to you this is a cool little thing okay this says little Amazon thing. I'm going to do the little thing again. It says, I have only been watching you for a short while, but I am all, I am so enjoying your channel. I'm a lifelong lover of horses, but I've never been able to have one of my own. I hope the boys enjoy this. God bless you. Tracy, you're awesome. I'm not going to say your last name, but thank you. And this, this is going to be so cute. I haven't opened it. So, but I did kind of read it through the thing. Check it out. That's gonna be so much fun. I'm gonna put this up. This is gonna be so neat. So it has a ball that you blow up in a ball. I guess there's a ball. It's just a little rubber ball. So we're gonna keep that there. And then it's got this net that goes around the ball. You put the ball inside the net and you squish your carrots around the holes like a, a hay net. Heck, I could even use this as a hay net. I have to fill it with hay and just kind of hang it. No, but we're gonna use it with a ball. We're gonna do it with carrots. And then it comes with its own little, hey, this is the same kind of material, but it's red. <laughs> that was weird. So it's got its own little string. So, um, oh, and a little clip. What's the clip for? Oh, the clip is to hang it, maybe. I don't know. Oh, that's the... Oh, that's the plug up the bowl. Hmm. Cool. Awesome. Oh, thank you, Tracy. This is going to be so much fun. I am going to be running out and about today. I'm going to put this back in. Um... I have two things that I have to do. I'm not sure if I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to do both of them. Let me turn this up a bit. There we go. But this is so cool. Oh, I can't wait to use it. Thank you. Oh, the boys are gonna love it. Uh, they just finished their supper. They're over there, I think. Um, but I've got a, a little something I gotta do today, and another little something I gotta do later tomorrow. I'm making fig jam right now from uh, that tree over there. That's a fig tree. <laughs> and um, yeah, so I'm making uh, fig jam right now. And I can't wait to use this. This is gonna be so much fun. I don't have any carrots right now, sorry. Um, but I know where I can get some. Thank you. They're gonna love it. I can't wait to show you the other video of them using it. So I've got the, the horse one all done. <laughs> We're gonna test it out on the dogs, see if they like it. See how it works. <laughs> we need to work together. Oh, looks like Snowy got hers. Come on, Eeyore, you can get it. <laughs> I'll help you. Good boy.
There you go. <laughs> Good job. This is fun. <laughs> Did you enjoy that? <laughs> I hope the horses are going to enjoy this as much as you guys just did. <laughs> yeah, it's all gone. So, I don't have any carrots, but I have horse treats. There's uh, Mrs. Pasture's treats for horses that uh, my mom brought over for Friday. And um, there's also some do more ones, which I usually don't like do more, but uh, um, they just happen to have some like, I think they're like, I don't know what kind of apple, something baked apple. So they're the boys. Let's see what they do. I got a treat for you guys. Want to try it out? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's all up. Let's see what happens. Hi. <laughs> What's up? I have a treat for you. You can try it. Try it. What's in there? What is it? it smells good, huh? Sometimes you gotta help them out. There's more in there. There's more in here. There you go. There's more in there. Hi, Mr. Nellis. You wanna give it a shot? He doesn't see it. Item. Oh, one fell out. <laughs> he says these are mine. Oh, there's another one fell on the floor fall on the ground. Mr. Nose is going to find it. There you go. Good boy. Found it. <laughs> oh, looks like Friday found it. You guys, your head's in the way. They're so big. But a couple fell out. <laughs> one fell in there. So one is in the barn. <laughs> and um, one fell out. So he found it. I think all the rest fell out too. <laughs> well, they certainly enjoyed it. And I'm going to leave it up there. And um, we're going to put some carrots in it next time. What do you think, boys? We'll put carrots in it next time. <laughs> this is my neighbor. She's walking. Where's the boys? <laughs> Alright, guys. Well, we'll see you uh, next time. Thanks for watching. And uh, it's always fun when these guys are out <laughs> doing something. I don't have anything in my hand, you. <laughs> it's all gone.
He's all gone, silly. <laughs> I know. I'll get some treats later. I will. Yes. Yes, I will. <laughs> I love him. He's such a good boy. <laughs> all right, guys. Well, thank you so much for sending that little toy. That is going to be so much fun when I put some carrots in it and uh, to watch them kind of pop for apples. So you guys have a great week. Um, it is Wednesday now and um, it's supper time. <laughs> it's supper time. And I've got to make them their supper and I hope you guys have a great night. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for watching. And we'll see you next time. Summerfield Farm and the big guys. Draft horses. <laughs> Dirty ones. Step on my feet. Such a good boy. <laughs> See you later, guys.